Craig Phillips, owner of Quality Water Treatment, also known as Craig the Water Guy at QualityWaterTreatment.com. Thank you for visiting us today. Uh, Quality Water Treatment has been in business since 1990. We're a family-owned and operated company. Today, I want to go over our salt-based softers as, lo as well as our salt-free water softers and ca compare them to Pelagon. Uh, Pelagon has been around for a few years. Uh, Quality Water Treatment has been around for longer. Uh, we have uh, gone through uh, a lot of uh, time and effort and to make sure that we supply you not just with the highest quality equipment available, but also the highest quality service before and after the sale. So let's go ahead and go over the comparisons uh, with you. First thing we're going to compare is our salt-based, our most popular model, which is our Soft Pro Elite Basic Salt-Based Water Softener, compared to the Pelican Salt-Based uh, Advantage Series. Okay. The Pelican Advantage Series softener uh, control valves of one inch, ported all the way through. Uh, the Soft Pro Elite Basic is also one inch, ported all the way through. Uh, the Pelican system, the control valve has a seven year warranty on it, uh, based on their information on their website here. And the Soft Pro Elite Basic has a 10 year warranty. So the Soft Pro Elite Basic has a better warranty on the control valve, 10 years compared to seven years. Uh, the tank uh, has a 12-year warranty on the Pelican system. Uh, the Soft Pro Elite Basic has a lifetime, manufacturer lifetime warranty on both tanks, the mineral tank and the brine tank. Uh, the Pelican system is a downflow system, so the water runs downward through the resin bed, uh, where the uh, Soft Pro Elite Basic is an upflow system, so the water runs down through the tube, upward through the resin. The advantage to that is that it's going to lift that bed up every single time so you don't have any channeling, so you get 100% contact with the bed, which is going to give you better performance. Uh, the uh, the resin that uh, Pelican uses is 8% cross-lake resin. Uh, Soft Pro Elite Basic uses an upgraded resin called 10% cross-lake resin. 10% cross-lake resin is more durable against chlorine and chloramines. Chlorine and chloramines in municipal water is enemy number one to resins. That's what tears them up. The 10% resin is going to last longer and be more durable against chlorine and chloramines over the 8% resin that the Pelican system uses. Uh, we have new age technology built into our soft pro control valves. Uh, they will save you up to 75% in salt and 64% on water per regeneration. The information is on our website, including charts and videos that goes over all the features uh, that uh, makes this possible. This will save a family of four up to $220 a year in salt and water alone. That's a huge savings. Uh, if you think about the life expectancy of these systems of being at least 20 years, this, this system is going to pay for itself and they continuously pay for itself over and over again over the life of the system. So that is the differences between the Salt Pro Elite Basic Basic System and the Pelican Salt uh, uh, Advantage Series uh, Salt Based Water Softener. Uh, we'll touch base out over that again real quick. The Salt Pro Elite Basic Control Valve is one inch. Uh, the Pelican is one inch. Uh, the Salt Pro Elite Basic has a ten year warranty on it. The Pelican only has a seven year warranty on it. The Soft Pro Elite Basic Softer Tank and the Brine Tank have a manufacturer lifetime warranty. The Pelican has a 12-year warranty. Uh, we are carrying a neoprene washable jacket. They carry a chrome non-washable jacket. We upgrade resin to 10%, which is more chlorine and chlorine resistant. Lasts longer, it performs better than the Pelican 8% resin. Uh, we have upflow regeneration and upflow uh, usage on the uh, on the Sopro system, uh, which is going to save you uh, between that and the, the new age technology built the control valve with all the different features, including the emergency regeneration and soft brine, brine, water brine refill, is going to save you up to 75% on salt and 64% on water every regeneration, which is an average saving of $220 per year. So uh, why would you go over a pel go with a Pelican system when you can get so something so much better with all the different features that's going to save you and your family money, not just on the initial purchase, but over the life of the system? So let's go with the uh, take a look at the uh, the salt free water softeners now.
Okay, quality water treatment carries uh, what we call the natural soft, okay, and the Pelagin salt free system is called nature soft. Uh, names are very uh, similar. They're actually the same systems, uh, they're just from two different companies. Uh, they both use uh, the same mineral tanks, they both use the same chrome jackets. They both use the same in and out valves with the bypass valves uh, included. Uh, they both use the same carbon cartridge with the carbon filter with the bracket, but they both use the same type of media. Okay. Uh, so they're really the same exact system. What, what, uh, what these systems do is they're not recommended for well water. They're rec recommended for municipal supply city water. And the reason why is because well water can have too many things in it that can, uh, diminish the performance of a salt-free water software. It doesn't matter whose it is. So quality water treatment, uh, we only offer these for city water. We do not want to sell them for somebody that's on their own private well for those reasons. So now what happens here is the water runs through, comes upward, and pushes up through the media, turns it over, and it breaks the minerals down, down into nanometer uh, particles so they can't adhere and stick to surfaces on a permanent basis. Works very well on city water under 25 grains of hardness. Uh, the Pelagon system works the exact same way. Uh, the difference here is that you'll notice that Pelagon is offering uh, two different size systems based on bathrooms. Uh, Quality Water Trade has been selling the salt-free water softeners now for about 12 years. Uh, we know uh, over trial and error of uh, the things that you should not do. And one of the things you should not do is oversize these systems. The way they work is the water runs through uh, the distributor tube comes upward through the media and then into the house. If this media doesn't get lifted up on a regular basis, it's not going to work properly. It has to be turned over. If it's not turned over on a daily basis uh, as you're using water, it just doesn't work very well at all. So for Pelican to say one to three bathrooms for one and four to six for the other is really not a good idea in my opinion uh, because of that reason. Uh, so let's say, for instance, you have four to six bathrooms in your home and you purchase their four to six bathroom system, but you only have two or three or maybe four people in the home and you're not going to be using four to six bathrooms at the same time where you're going to be running all four showers, six hours at the same time or running a bunch of sinks or bathtubs, stuff like that. Uh, this size of system is going to you know, require uh, X gallons per minute to lift that bed up on a regular basis. So if you oversize the system to cover 10, 15 percent of your actual usage based on flow rates uh, versus go with a smaller system uh, to cover 90 percent, you know, 85 to 90 percent of your usage on flow rates, you're going to have some issues. So you're better off to go with the smaller system. If you're going to use higher flow rates above 12 gallons per minute, for instance, which is a lot of water, uh, then it's still going to cover that. It's still going to treat your water, okay? Uh, but it's not going to treat it quite as good for that short period of time that you're using over 12 gallons per minute. But that 90% of the time where you're using less than 12 gallons per minute, this system is going to work very well for you. So that's the reason why quality water treatment has gone with the one size fits all. This is a 9x48 tank. It only takes a little bit over a gallon per minute to lift this bed up and turn it over, which a shower, just one single shower will take care of for you. Where if you go with this system here, it's going to require closer to three gallons per minute to lift that bed. And uh, even your standard shower is not going to lift that bed. So it would take a lot of water usage uh, on a regular basis to lift that bed. Most homes only use between uh, 0.5 to 4 gallons per minute uh, in, inside your home uh, on a regular basis. Okay. Uh, so I hope that explains everything to you folks. And if you have any more questions, please give us a call at 866-278-4130 or use the live chat on our website or use the contact page to send us an email. Thank you very much and have a great day.